جامعة ماست هي جامعة جديدة ومتألقة في مجال التطور التكنولوجي تتقري باللغة الإنجليزية وتوفر دي ليسونس ودي ماستير في سوفتوير انجينيرينج داتا ساينس سايبر سيكيورتي اي ارتفيشال انتليجنس اسسها مجموعه من العلماء المتميزين في العالم اللي مستعدين بخبراتهم وعلاقاتهم باش يعاونوا ويأطروا كل تلميذ مغروم بالانفورماتيك ويطمح انه يتمتع بدراسه ذات جوده عاليه تفتح له افاق عالميه اما في اكمال دراسته البرة في جامعات مرموقه ولا في التحصل على شغل بسرعه في تونس ولا البر وزاد في تأطير وتشغيله في البحوث التقنيه عبر المراكز العالميه ماس يونيفرستي موجوده في الاكتروا واتصل بينا Aslema, <coughs> donc l'Um, we will speak about a major problem for some pupils, mainly during the tests. L'exercice, put the verb in the correct tense or form. Most of the pupils find this exercise very, very difficult. Fama claim that they call me la jam shnacht moun an exercise, he da men fermouch. Wa ella. Fama claim da kines el hom. Uh, how do you choose the appropriate tense or the appropriate form of the verb? Some of them answer that it depends on the context. Others say that it's a question of feelings. Ena ushan hiss, madam. Ena ukifishan hiss ul verb. Donc, en jewab hasb al ahsas. أغوني سيبا بوسيبل ما نجموش نجاوبو حسب الإحساس على خاطر كان فما إكزاكسيس أه، تنجم تاخد فيه فول مارك معناتها ما تضيعش منه حتى زيرو سانك هو put the verb in the correct tense of form شنو يلزمنا؟ يلزمنا نعرفو شنو ما التنسز اللي نتوما تعرفوهم يلزم نعرف كيفاش تكتب التنس وشنو ما التنس إنديكيتورز معناتها في كل إكزاكسيس في كل جملة لازم باش تلقى انديكاتور يقول لك شنو المطلوب منك ولا شنو هو الطون اللي يلزمك تستعمله وما تستعملش طون اخر دونك فور توداي سيشن وي ويل تراي تو انتروديوس ذا انجلش تانسيس تو ميك انديرستاندينغ ذيم اند تو ميك ذا اكسرسايز بوت ذا فيربس ان ذا كوريكت تانس اوف فورم ان ايزي تاسك فور يو لازم تكون حاجه سهله لازم كي تلقاه في دوفوار تمشي ديريكت ليكزرسيس هذاك خاطر انت متمكن منه باش نبدا في لي طون انجليش تانسيس وي ويل ستارت وذ ذا سيمبل بريزنت اول حاجه ذا سيمبل بريزنت از يوزد تو سبيك اباوت ريبيتد اكشن ا هابيت ا روتين اند ا جنرال تروث حاجه نعملها ونعودها ونعملها ونعودها هذيك اسمها a habit or a routine donc we use the simple present what is the structure of the simple present شمعنا it has structure كيفاش نكتبو الفيربين يدكتب سوجي plus verb كما الاكزامبل I speak Arabic you speak Arabic uh, they speak English و اذا كان السوجي متاعي يبدا هي ولا شي ولا it الفيرب يلزم نزيدو s I speak Arabic, you speak Arabic, he speaks, uh, she speaks Arabic. It uh, opens uh, the door or the window. Donc, dima, n'arfo hal qada hedi, min l'oul bil kul, eli le sujet, le hi ou shi ou it, fil présent, yekhdu es. Tau wa wakte ech nistamlu, shnu ma ena kutukum kbila fama des indicateurs, fama hakka haja. هي اللي باش توجهك الاثنين فما كلمات باللونجلي كي تلقاهم قبل الفيرب ولا بعد الفيرب في نفس الجمله يلزمك تستعمل السيمبل بريزنت هذوم اسمهم تانس انديكيتورز وات ار ذا تانس انديكيتورز فور ذا بريزنت اولويز يوجولي اوفن سام تايمز ريرلي افري داي Every month, every year. If there is something we do always, or often, or every day, so it is a habit. It is a routine. And another present. There is another present in the English language, which is the present progressive. So we call it a simple present. We talk about habitude. We talk about routine, repeated action. The present progressive is used to speak an. about an action that's taking place now at the moment of speaking or to speak about short 
temporary action that has a short duration. Donc, زوز بريزون واحد يحكي على حاجه ديما تصير وديما تتعاود هذيك سيمبل بريزنت والبريزنت بروجريسيف سبيكس اباوت ان اكشن ناو ات ذيس مومنت شنو هي الستركتور نتاعو سوجي نتاعنا الفيرب تو بي بلس فيرب بلس اي ان جي فور ان اكزامبل اي ام سبيكينغ انجلش I am listening to music. I am watching TV. I am eating. Donc, وقت اللي نستعملو هذيا ل I am will verb with the ing form. It means that I am speaking about something taking place now, at the moment. نثبتو لي عليش في الجملة الأولى نقولو I speak Arabic because I am Tunisian. Because Arabic is my language. Because when I am with my friends and with my family, I speak Arabic. In the present progressive, I am speaking English. Because it's now, at this moment, I am speaking English. But in general, I don't speak in English. Or when I'm in class, when I'm with English people, I I'm obliged at that time to speak in English. There is another present with, uh, sorry, before we move, the tense indicators of the present progressive, huma, now, at the moment, in this day, or in these days, at this time, at this moment, look, when I say to someone, look, look, the teacher is coming, look, The baby is crying. Donc, we look at something taking place when I am speaking. Now, we'll move to the second tense, or the third one, or another type of present, which is the present perfect. Now, The present perfect tense is a tense that is used to speak about an action that started in the past and continues up to the present, or an action that started in the past with a present consequence. This tense is the most commonly used tense in English. أكثر نستعملو في الانجلي. دونك باش نحكيو به هو اسمه present. أما نحكيو بي in the past حاجة started in the past بديت في الباسي وما وفيتش في الباسي it continues up to now what is the structure of the present perfect tense subject ومع has or have and the past participle of the verbs شنو هو وقتش نستعملو الهاز مع he she it will have I, you, we, and they. Now, what are the tense indicators? وقتش باش نستعملو هال present perfect tense. عنا for and period. For example, he has been a pupil for 11 years. معناتها عندو 11 سنة وهو يقرا حتى لتوا ما وفاتش القراية. Another indicator, since. Since plus date. He has been a pupil since 2005. Since 2010. For example, ever when it is in the question. Have you ever been to the United States? There are two possible answers. Yes, well, no. If my answer is no. No, I have never been to the states donc ma ever or never is in instamel present perfect tense with a kind answer yes yes i have already visited the united states or i have already visited many countries of the world we also use the present perfect when i have just 
He has just come home from work. We use it with recently. An example, she has recently obtained her degree. And uh, other tense indicators Almost. I have almost finished uh, reading the book. Only about 10 pages are left. What does it mean, almost? Presque. Haja presque amalta. We also use it with yet. I have not finished my exams yet. We use it with so far. So far, I have visited many countries of the world. Shnoa so far, up to now. We also use it with up to now. Up to now, the score is still the same. So, what must we keep in mind? The present perfect tense is the tense that is most commonly used in English. أكثر طعم استعملوه والحاجة اللي يزمن نحطوها في بيننا ونثبتوا فيها كي نبدأ ونخدمو هما التانس indicators We move now The simple past The simple past is used to speak about an action that happened in the past with no relationship with the present or the future Donc an action that started and finished in the past. Tau shnei struktur ki fe shi tkteb simple past. Di ma yizemni subject plus verb u ida ken el verb regulier, regular verb. I add ed. If it is irregular, then I must choose my irregular pasts. Example of regular verbs. Walk, walked, open. Opened, close, closed. Example of irregular past. To go, the past went. To have, the past had. To speak, the past spoke. Donc, on a dit, on a dit, on a dit, on a now, what are the tense indicators of the past? When do I use the past? The indicators, yesterday, ago, last, last week, last month, last year, in the past, when, when I was a kid, when I was a young child, etc. A past date, text paragraph, in 1950, in 1920. So it's a date that indicates the past. Once, or once upon a time, we find this expression when we deal or when we talk about fairy tales, when it is a story of the past. Then and at that time. There is another past, which is the past progressive. Just like the present progressive, the past progressive takes the ing form. What is the past progressive first? It's used to speak an, about an action in progress in the past, interrupted by another action also in the past. Donc, haja can see, G haja action okhra kosaliha. What is the structure, subject, plus verb to be in the past, plus verb, and the ing form? The tense indicators, when or suddenly. An example, I was watching TV when, suddenly, my sister arrived. Now, next tense that we'll come across is the past perfect. The past perfect is used to speak about an action that had a duration in the past before another action in the past too. Mani the action khdit waqta fil passé. 
ومن بعدها جيت اكشن اخرى وات از ذا ستراكشر سبجكت بلس هاد اند ذا باست بارتيسيبل ان اكزامبل اي هاد بين ا بيوبل ان ذيس برايمري سكول فور فايف ييرز بيفور اي موفد تو ماي سيكندري سكول ان 2005 دونك هو قرا خمس سنين في البريمير في المكتب هذيك قبل ما يمشي ليكول سكوندير وكلهم صاروا في الباسي مشي ليكول سكوندير في 2005 وقرا في ليكول بريمير من 2000 ل 2005 دونك هير وي ار سبيكينغ اباوت ان اكشن بيفور انذر اكشن in the past the next tense is the future tense as it is indicated the future is used to indicate that an action is going to take place in the future what's the structure of the future i need subject and will and verb in the bare infinitive form Shmanita bear infinitive, the verb without to. I will go, I will speak, you will find, you will uh, travel, you will study, etc. What are the indicators of the future? Tomorrow, soon, in the future, next week, next month, next year, tonka andi, next. It means that I'm speaking about a future event or a future date in 2050 in 2030 what will happen or the expression the coming the coming week the coming days etc fine what is left now it is the conditional the other part of the For the conditions in English, there are three types of conditions. Condition type one, which is used to speak about real situation in the present. Example, if I study hard, I will succeed. Donc, structure inter is an if mal présent, but nestamlu le futur. If I work seriously, I will get a good mark. If I have a lot of money, I will travel abroad. Condition type two. This is used to speak about unreal present, a hypothetical situation, a daydream. Donc, en akad, and I'm imagining. Haja medabeya tsir. I'm not sure but I'm making a dream. I'm making a wish. What's the rule for a condition type 2? If plus past, would plus verb. An example. If I had a lot of money, I would buy a big castle. Now, at the moment, I don't have money. I cannot buy a big castle. كان جاي عندي برشا فلوس نشري قصر اما انا لا عندي فلوس لا باش نجم نشريه القصر but what am i doing i'm just daydreaming i'm just making a wish about something in the present that is impossible to achieve condition type 3 now this condition is used to speak about a past event that did not happen and that you regret now. However, it's too late and nothing can be done anymore. Donc, now, condition one or two, you about the present. Wahda is real, possible, Well, condition type two is unreal. Condition type three speaks about the past, something that happened in the past and you regret now but it is too late ma'ach tnajm tbaddel situation shnia structure nteha 
هذيا كومبليكي شوية نوسعو بالنا شوية ونفهموها إف ومن بعدها هاد ومن بعد الباس بارتيسيبو و دوزيم بارتي وود ومعها هاف مع الباس بارتيسيبو أن إكزامبل If I had slept early, I would have arrived on time. شنو هي الجملة؟ كان القط بكري. راني وصلت في الوقت. دونك هذه حاجة صارت. في الحقيقة، اسكو أنا رقدت بكري؟ لا. اسكو خلطت في الوقت؟ لا. توا، now I regret. But it is too late. Nothing can be changed. Now we will try to talk about the models. You all know what are the models in English. I'm sure that you know them, but probably some of you don't know that we call them models. What are the English models that are used before or after a subject, in general before a subject, uh, sorry, after a subject, or before a subject in a question, after a subject, when I just giving a sentence. The models are can, could, must, have to, had to, shall, should, will, would, ought to, may, might, need to. With a can narrow the module here, the module of Uh, in lesson number four, you will have a list of tables with the models and their indications. خاطر كل واحد يأدي معنى يأدي وظيفة. دونك شبيهم هاو المودولز هادو؟ They must be used with verb in the bare infinitive form. They must be followed by a verb without to. ساعات اللاحظ اللي تلامدة متاعي يغلطو I can speaking I must going I shall uh, writing I will uh, listening to music and this is a mistake نسألهم علاش تستعملو في ING form one of the pupils gave me a very funny answer ضحكتني الغيبانس فدلكنا بها في القسم قالي مدام كي نستعمل ING نحس روحي اللي أنا نتكلم باللونجلي اي نجمو نستعملوها ال ing اما ما نجموش نستعملوها في فيرب كي يبدا قبلو فما مودول وقت غالطه تنجم تستعملها في البريزنت بروجريسيف في الباست بروجريسيف مع سيرتن فيربس توا باش نشوفوهم اللي يلزم بعدهم الفيرب في ال ing فورم اما اذا كان عندي المودولز نردو بالنا ما نجم نحط بعدو كان فيرب نحيلو تو ونخليه في البير انفينيتيف مع اي يو وي ذي هي شي ات نلقوا قدامو ناو ولا ات ذا مومنت ولا تومورو ولا نكست ويك هذوك الكل ما عندهم حتى قيمه ما نجم نستعمل الفيرب بعد المودل كان في البير انفينيتيف فور قلت لكم انا فما دي فيرب اللي من بعدهم هما نجم نستعمل اي ان جي شكون هما لي فيرب هادو؟ خدينا اللي أكثريتهم نستعملوهم what we call verbs of perceptions love, hate, enjoy, prefer, detest, like, dislike, cherish, loathe loathe هي yeah, to hate شبيهم هادوما؟ هادوما دي فيرب related to emotions مربوطين بالأحاسيس متاعنا معناتها ما نجمش لي فيرب هادوم نستعملهم in the ing form علاش؟ شقلنا احنا ال ing form present progressive I use it to speak about short action ما تنجمش تجي العبد تقول له I am loving you now اي ومن بعد what will happen I love you I like you I Uh, hate uh, sports I uh, dislike uh, loud music I'm a, when we talk about someone I love or I don't love donc les verbes 
verbs of perception are never used in the ing form. But they must be followed by a noun or a verb in the ing form. Example, I love my family. I love my father. I uh, prefer English. I enjoy English. Or I like music. I like listening to music. I love watching TV. I enjoy going out. Donc, les verbes هذم هما ما نستعملهمش في الإي إن جي. أما إذا كان عندي فيرب من بعدهم، الفيرب هذاكا ما نجم نستعملو كان في الإي إن جي فور. So, this is an occasion for you to understand that models are never followed by the ING. Verbs of perception are never used in the ING form, but they can be followed by a verb in the ING form. That's all for this quick revision. We shall meet hopefully next time. Goodbye.